objective of this gala is to show two things. Number one, what Sciences Po and political science generally can bring to the world in terms of knowledge and experience. And the second objective is to raise awareness and funds to fund the Sciences Po scholarship program. I had the tremendous opportunity of being awarded the Michel David Weil scholarship. And A, without it, I would not be at Sciences Po. And I think Sciences Po is, well, has already changed the way I look at the world. I intend, after I finish my master's at Sciences Po, to go into the US military and to stay in government, whether military or civilian, for as much of my career as I can finagle. First, I owe you an update on our campus in Paris. We discussed that at some length last year. And I am glad to be able to announce that Sciences Po is very shortly, at last, going to proceed with the acquisition of the Hôtel de l'Artillerie, so close to our beloved Bank de saint -Dieu. Second important subject, equal opportunity. Je bénéficie de la bourse Marion Brûlé et euh, en effet c'était vraiment indispensable pour moi de l'obtenir euh, puisque déjà le coût de la vie à New York est très élevé et notamment le logement. Euh, je suis déjà boursière à Sciences Po. Uh, I've had the privilege to receive uh, the David Great Scholarship. I am a dual degree uh, student. I was last year in uh, the Paris School of International Affairs, SIA. Uh, and now I am studying at uh, the School of Public and International Affairs at Columbia University. Uh, there I, uh, in both cases, I concentrate in international security policy, human rights and conflict resolution. So organizing this kind of event tonight is a, is a great, uh, great thing to do because it makes the community of the uh, alum alumni of Sciences Po here uh, uh, more vibrant. For many years I've been working for the State of Israel in the Ministry of Justice. Later on, I was appointed with the Supreme Court to the role of a Chief Justice. I was the first woman. I was also the first woman to be the State Attorney of Israel. The theme of the gala this year is women leaders. And we have three extraordinary women who will be on stage. We have Bianca Jagger, who is a human rights activist and a longtime human rights activist, as well as an alumni of Sciences Po. I think that Sciences Po open many doors for me. We will also have Dr. Karen Gunfried, who is uh, the former advisor to the President uh, Obama, uh, responsible for European affairs, and the current head of the German Marshall Fund. To me, Sciences Po is the place where you go if you are French and want the best education you can have, if you're an American who cares about the wider world, and if you're from other countries around the world and want to be part of a, dyna a dynamic international student body. And then our third guest is a French citizen who's also an alumni of Sciences Po, Virginie Morgan, who's the deputy CEO of Euraseo. Sciences Po has been, you know, part of my happiest years. So of course, you know, very naturally, I'm here to give back what I got from the school. Sciences Po.